Nandosi Jaichi. I am a 17 year old from Cape Town, South Africa. I also happen to be your Miss Teenager South Africa 2023 finalist. So, as for Youth Day, I was given a task by the organization that I must do something that I enjoy doing, that I'm also skilled in. So, like, what more am I good at besides baking, right? So, I've got all the ingredients here. Um, I've got flour in this bit. <laughs> I've got flour. I've got a bowl that we're using to put everything inside. I've got the seed. I've got a muffin mix, vanilla flavor. I've got vanilla essence. I've got grated carrots. Grated carrots. I've got baking powder. I've got four eggs. Four eggs, right? I've got an empty mug so I can pour this cooking oil or fish oil and this milk inside. I've also got my spray and cook so I can actually spray this in this muffin hole. So without any further ado, good people, let's bake. So as you guys can see, I am done sieving the flour, but there are these um, really small balls here. You shouldn't pour this stuff back inside because now what is the point of me sieving in the first place, right? So we're going to go and throw this either in the sink or in the dustbin or your bin. Thank you.
guys, as you can see, my mixture is really like nice and thick. Please, like when you're adding um, more water or more milk, don't just add everything like extra at once. Add a bit, like half a mug, a mug of water or milk, and then just the punch is really thick. Otherwise, if you don't, um, as in pour half a mug each time, you might like really sit with a really, really um, wet and watery a mixture and we don't want that. We want proper muffins, okay? So this is the route or the way to go. Now I'm going to add some vanilla essence shell. Vanilla essence shell, okay? Um, I'm not gonna add too much. Maybe like, if you want to measure and be accurate, maybe like four teaspoons, or three teaspoons is gonna be actually perfect. Now let's just stir everything together. <laughs> okay. Now everything is I mean, actually it looks good. I mean it smells good. I feel like the vanilla essence um plays a role of making the entire thing just smell really really good. Right? So now we are off to the next stage as we're going to now cover this. We're gonna clean this put it in my a mug with water, right? Then we are going to cover this and put it there on the side for a while. Now we're going to spray these muffin pans. <laughs> so like I said earlier, good people, um, I covered my muffin mixture. I also added my two spoons that I'm actually going to be using throughout this whole um, taking my muffin mixture onto my muffin pan. I did add water so it comes much more easier for like when I wash the dishes later. So now we are going to shake shake this thing for a shower. <laughs> and then spray the surface of my muffin Wait for it to go and ding a ling a ling. <laughs> okay, muffins are preheated successfully, so now we're gonna need to cover our hands to protect them because there's no way we are going to touch a hot pan with our bare hands. And I put it to do the same. So I'm gonna place this on this glass um, surface because we don't wanna damage our kitchen counter now, do we? Nope. Okay. Our mixture. Time for us to pour. Just It's also like very important to like dip inside the water. Hence is why I said put the spoon in a in a mug of water so you can just dip like even like now and then because we like just carry out pouring this mixture and taking it and pouring it onto your muffin pan. The mixture might as well just stick onto your muffin pan, yeah? And then we don't want that. So I just advise you to keep on dipping every like two rounds or one round of pouring the muffin mixture onto your muffin pan. Right? So And don't worry about the stains on my pen. I'm going to be able to clean it later on before I transfer this onto, actually into the oven. So when I take this into the oven, I'm going to take the other second pen out. No, 
because when I have a lot of stuff on my counter, I don't like working with um, too much things with even ingredients. This is why you see the stuff I actually used earlier in the video is actually gone. <laughs> I don't like having a busy more busy counter when I'm busy in the kitchen. So guys, since now I've got this much um, muffin mixture left. I'm actually going to pour the rest of this onto this pan. So we're gonna have some kind of muffins and mini cake situation going on. Because you know, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. <laughs> you know? Okay, so now you're going to pour, actually place all of this inside here. Right. Then you are going to set the timer. Everything should still be the same. Don't nab or put it with the put it with the buttons. We are going to place it for like 15 minutes. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15. And then it's quite important for you to keep on checking up on your muffins because they might burn. So like just keep on coming like in like five minutes every now and then. Come and check.